Hello, my name is Gabriel from Gaba QSA. In this video, we're going to talk about virtualization support. As you will know, uh, AMD and Intel, they have their own system, how to run multiple computers at the same time. If you don't know, that is what it's all about. So in this case, uh, all the latest uh, micro microprocessors have that option, of course. And I think since uh, 2000, uh, Intel had the, that option already so that you can run multiple computers. But the thing is, uh, make sure when you build a computer that that option is enabled. Some motherboards, they have that option disabled, but most of them they are enabled already. So the thing is, on the, on the old ages, when you just had your first computer or something like that, um, I'm talking about maybe if, uh, 15 years ago or, more, or a little bit more uh, when the CPU didn't have that option, uh, this uh, feature. So programmers have to program a lot more. They have to code a lot more in order to make work and to run maybe two operating systems or more at the same time. Today, the thing is easier with this new feature that most of the operating system uh, has already. They don't have to code that much, and it's easier to handle all the memory RAM, the the processors, the the process, and and everything uh, of every instruction. So that is why you have to have uh, this option enabled. Otherwise, you may uh, get some error on the screen when you are running maybe VMware or hyper uh, hypervisor or some kind of uh, software like maybe VirtualBox or something like, like that. So you make sure if you go to the BIOS, in the BIOS you are going to be able to uh, enable this option. That is easy. I'll show you surely in, with the screenshot how you can do that. And, and after that, uh, that's it. I mean, this uh, subject is, is very long. I, I made another videos already about about this, so but because we are talking about the CPUs and everything else, it's something that you you have to know that is on the computer already. So make sure that it's enabled and everything will be okay. So like like always, remember uh, see my other videos, prior videos on the playlist, so that way you can start from the beginning and understand things much better. Also, if you want to see uh, or if you want to watch all my other videos about virtualization, you can do it that as well. Remember, if you want to buy my classes or if you want to ask a question, you can do it in the comment in the section below. Also, you can go to the forum if you want to publish some videos or maybe some uh, pictures or something like that. So I hope it was helpful for you. Remember, click like, subscribe, and see you next class. Bye.